Good afternoon, Hornets. Welcome back to another episode of Live from 205. I'm your host, Gianna, along with Sajida, and we're here to give you this week's PV updates. This week in TV and film history, Gene Roddenberry completed his 16-page pitch for the TV show Star Trek. PV alum DC Fontana would go on to write 10 episodes for the show. Don't forget our PV softball team. Feeling hungry? Stop by Wendy's from 5 to 8 p.m. on Tuesday, March 19th. 15% of all sales will be donated to the Passaic Valley High School softball team. Speaking of food, 205's favorite duo took a trip around the world for some Sarku Sushi, or rather, the Willowbrook Mall. Hey guys, it's Sajana and Jumpy with the camera, and today we're at Willowbrook and we're going to be reviewing Sarku Japan. <laughs> We just got sushi. I got shrimp tempura. I got spicy crab. Mine was, <laughs> my spicy crab rolls were six dollars, and it literally took them like five minutes. It to was get, very get ready. quick. It yeah. was so quick. Okay, so now we are gonna try. I'm gonna try my shrimp tempura, and she's gonna try her spicy crab. Mm. Okay, ready? One, two, three. It is good. It's just this one's good. It's just like flavorless here. Like it's a little bland. Okay, now I'm gonna try the um, spicy crab, and she's gonna try the shrimp tempura. Are right, you ready? One, two, three. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap, that was really funny. It's really bland. <laughs> Bro, not even bland. That's like not shrimp. <laughs> that is not shrimp. I, me, I give the shrimp tempura like an 8 out of 10. It is a little, like a 7 out of 10. It is a little bland, but nothing too bad. <laughs> I give, you, I give the shrimp tempura a negative 5 out of 10 because why is it making me gag? Like, why is it making me gag? Why did it make me feel that way? I, I'm not, I don't rock with this. Okay, that's our review. Bye, guys. Bye. Okay, Juniors, it is officially 12 days to Cotillion. Get those tickets, get that dress, get the suit, and get ready for a magical night under the stars. Tickets are available online. Hey, PV Hornets, while watching your live from 205, why not tune in to how the show works from behind the scenes? Here's Jen and Judah with our behind the scenes of live from 205. Cool, hi, well, I have everybody's attention. I'm gonna do the teacher review thing. So the um, food review, I still like it. You girls do good at that every time. The one thing I will say is in the beginning, we couldn't really hear Saj, and that's just falling victim to um, uh, kind of filming in a big public space, but also using the onboard mic with the camera. So I know we've tried with the little ones before, but maybe we should try it again, um, or just find a different space that's not in front of vending machines and stuff too. That was a weird background. Um, and I know one of your crewmates called you out on that too. So. Um, otherwise, that was good. And then the only other thing I'll say is that the review, Gianna kept going in and out of frame. So one thing we could experiment with is the different cameras we got too, or I mentioned before, like using one of the GoPros and sending it to the wide angle, um, would be great for that because then we wouldn't lose you at all. So we have 56 seconds till the video comes back. So this one, I think is great. It's a good like B-roll. But the one thing I will say is that this needed like voiceover of what goes on day to day with it instead of just being like a highlight reel of, of the class. So I think the clips are good, the shots are good. But for a video that, that's supposed to be behind the scenes, but it's not the most what's going on. So um, that's my critique on that. We come back in 25 seconds.
That wraps up this week's episode of Live from 205. See you soon with more videos and PV updates.